Hello everyone, welcome back to another playthrough of Nier Automata. Last thing we did was that we defeated the singing robot again. Um, and... That's about it. <laughs> we did a couple of the side quests and stuff like that. We went back to resistance camp and gave the, um, oil filter to an enemy. Um... And now, what I'd like to do, there we go, I think I'm having a hard time, I'm going, ugh, I can only chase with through Barker, that sucks. Alright, we're going to go to the desert, so you can complete this Jean Paul side quest, because that'd be nice, see if I can remember how to get to the desert, I hadn't been over there in a little bit. I was, um, cause I'm doing this thing on my Instagram, my private Instagram account, where, um, I am doing a 30 day anime music challenge where, like, they give you a prompt, like, oh, the scariest anime you ever watched, or something like that. And, um, I just did, what was it? An anime you wish there was another season for. And,. Uh, I could not remember the end, name of the anime for the life of me. Like I had to go onto the website where I watched these animes and I finally figured out what it was called. And it's called um, Orient. I've talked about it before. It's really good. Uh, I love that show. Loved it. But they only have one season of it. So. And they left it on kind of a cliffhanger. So like, I will absolutely love it if they continue that show. Alright you guys. Greatly enjoy that show. I think I have the occasional stupid sexual nonsense, but um it was it was it, I don't remember being as bad as other shows. It was pretty, it was relatively tame, from what I remember. Oh, i never been over here before. How the fuck am I supposed to get that stuff? Just floating there. Oh, now it's gone. Oh well. Oh, thought I had to. Hack into it or something. But yeah, very good show. <laughs> I've gotten up there before. I think I see how. Nope, that wasn't it. I've gotten up there before, I definitely have. Can you grab the ledge, 9S? Got 
Father Servo. <laughs> not too shabby, not too shabby at all. I'm the warrior monk, Father Ser Servo. I will seek the enlightened path through the perfection in battle. Father Servo? But alas, there's only so much Father Servo is capable of on his own. Perhaps you would be so good as to aid a fellow on his spiritual journey. Sorry, I drank some water. My throat's getting dry. Uh, I'm not sure sure we can help. We should be helping machine at combat training. Oh, ho, ho, ho. fear of the unknown clouds your mind. Oh, fear of the unknown clouds your mind, young one. What's in it for us? Father Servo shall impart upon you all his secret battle arts. I don't know, to be. This seems pretty suspicious. What do you think? Why not? The heavens smile upon Father Servo this day. Now then, let us start with a light round of sparring. Enough, enough, follow your servo yields. I don't think this guy is quite as tough as he lets on. Well, it was a nice workout, at least. <laughs> nice. Yes, well, good for you. Now then, I was paying for you this lesson. You must bring Father Servo a warped wire. What? Listen, you didn't say anything about bringing. We spied, yes. You learned many things. Yes. Then surely an, uh, an amusement is to be expected. This guy is shameless. You should be able to retrieve a warp wire from the dinosaur light machine warming about nearby. Bring it here for our next bout, if you would be so kind. Have you brought the acquired item? Ah, excellent! Now we can gain a new form of training. Our oh, server will accept your challenge whenever you feel ready. For free, of course. Of course. Oh, nice. Robo Dojo White Belt. Hmm. All right, let's uh, get to the desert now. I refuse to fight these guys right now. We are going to go to um, the desert so we can find the lady. The pretty lady who is enthralled with Jean Paul. As always, I have food in the oven, so I will have to check it soon. The Council of Humanity has a message for all of our brave androids fighting on the surface. It has been several millennia since the aliens and their advanced force, the machine life forms, attacked us. Millennia since mankind was forced to evacuate to the surface of the moon. But thanks to your continued struggle, we have been able to survive. You, our android soldiers, are the last hope of humanity. We look forward to your continued success in combat. Glory to mankind. Okay. <clears throat> Let's read this message. Oh, TV saw stuff. Oh, she's had a lot of stuff. We have a recent one. In recent years, we received reports that many pe peculiar units have been sighted among the machine life forms. We have also heard troubling reports of enemies approaching androids under a so called banner. Peace, do not let yourself be deceived. Yeah, we know. I could ride. The animal. <laughs> this would be nice. Be able to ride a moose. All right, so let me actually. Thanks, Moose. Uh, let me look them out and see if I can find out where in the desert she supposedly is. She's way in there. She's deep in there. What's this way? 
Hmm. Oh yeah, by the way, this is going to be like a 30 to 40 minute playthrough. Not very long. Because soon my food ready, I am eating. Because I want cake. And I kind of want Babylon. I'm very intrigued. That was close. Seems like hacking things give you a lot of experience points allowing you to level up a lot faster. <laughs> Alright. Is this the right direction? Hmm. Cause this is where we met like these um maybe yeah this looks oh look at that how did i get hit you should be ashamed of yourself <laughs> what is it oh money i'll take it I'm upset with that. So why is this girl in this desert? Like she deep in here. <laughs> mm, yeah, she's like in one of these buildings or something. There's also something all the way up there. Let's see if we can grab that real quick. <sighs> Weekends are so short. It's already five o'clock on my first day of the week, and then tomorrow I have to work, meaning um, do my taxes and stuff. So I'll be probably getting up relatively early, so I can get on the phone, so I can get some information on some tax forms that I need, um, and get right on to my taxes. Real quick, I really saw my food. I'm gonna pause real quick. I'll be right back. Alright, and my pizza is perfect. Heck yeah. Alright. So this is where the lady is, I think. That's my guess. Uh, hello there. Ack. Huh? You came here from Master Paul, Jean Paul's village, didn't you? I can tell, I can smell him on you. Okay, that's weird. Jean Paul is wonderful. He pursues new knowledge of a passion that is almost indescribable. I admire him as do no other. You have issues. And you carry like a discerning eye. I bet men take advantage of you all the time. Not exactly. <laughs> ah, right. I found something that Master Jean Paul should be interested in. Please, take it to him with all speed. Hey, 2B, I've been thinking about something. What? Do you think this... <laughs> Did he just leave? Did he just... That's certainly one way to put it. 2... 9S! I'm not sure what he said. Oh man, I wish I hadn't... Oh, it's so lame.
Because he definitely, you think this, <laughs> like, I think you call him an effer or something. Just like, oh my, 9S. Someone's a little spicy today. But, yeah, that dude might be playing with all these girls' emotions straight up. <clears throat> Which is not, not cool. So not cool. All right, so now we need to get out of here. And it looks like we might be able to get back up here. Maybe. No. The stand really is slippery. Here we go. Running in sand is hard. It's so soft. So the cross like shifts under your weight. Sounds almost bad for your knees to a point. Alright. Let's see if we can find um a logical way and quick way to get out of here. Cause if you can't tell this place is huge. things cool project gestalt report eight whoa 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 sir I'm not trying to deal with you thank you very much project gestalt you have my attention. We're gonna have to read that. Let me get you a safe place and we read it. Um, I don't think this is considered a safe place. Let me see. Let me look up the archives. Archives. Here it is. Summary 152053. Summary. As Project Gestalt undergoes approval in countries across the world, we recognize that there have been imperfections in how information has been regu regulated with regards to civilians. Until the safety of the final system has been verified, oops, all information related to this matter is subject to level 4 classifications. As such, it's restricted to the Min Ministry of Health and Welfare's Life Rehabilitation Program must be kept strictly confidential. Furthermore, we ask that the following information be sent to all related personnel and organizations immediately. Clauses regarding compensation in the event of information leaks are to be added to contracts with all partner companies. In the event of information leak, ascertaining the source should be the company's top priority. Please refer to Countermeasure C for information on how to handle leaked information as well as the individuals who disclosed it. Hmm. So near happened near Gristow and all that stuff happened before this game. At least that's what it seems like. I was about to say, where are we? Alright. See if we made it out. See if we can find the moose. He made it left us, which I wouldn't blame it. That's it's so freaking big. There's probably a million and ten different things I haven't realized out here. 
Am I going in the right direction? Yes, I think so. All right, so we're going to go back to the um, Pascal's village. We have to go there anyway for the main mission. And we're going to talk to um, the man. And then we have to probably go back to the desert, unfortunately. We, we, we might do that another time. It takes so long. Of course, with the moose, it shouldn't take as long. I really wish you had the transport. I say, let me get on the moose. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> to Pasco's village. Right direction. Yeah, this is right. All right. Oh, so now they're moose that we can use. Nice. Talk to Jean Paul, talk to Pasco, and we'd probably do the main mission for a little bit. Just stick with the main mission for us to play through today. Hey, jerk. Indeed, indeed, there is any is there any purpose or need to the object we find in the world? Consider, if you will, this place or this village, or even myself, if such a We're here with a present for you. A present of what sort? It's a fossil, one of your followers asks us to deliver it to you. I see, I see. She said you were indescribably passionate when it came to learning, or something like that. A mechanical fossil, <laughs> no use at all. Do you want us to tell anything on your behalf, or I'll not waste my words on mere junk? Junk? Jean-Paul doesn't seem to appreciate these presents he's getting. I suppose she could go tell his followers exactly what he thinks of them, huh? They'd be waiting for some kind of reply. We get to destroy everything. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh, he, he did it again? Wait! You're that kind of android from before! I hate to admit this, but my son has locked him himself inside again. I figured he'd be over that by now. I, he tried so hard. I know he did, but fear has gotten the better of him. And, well, here we are. The lock is even stronger this time. Without your aid, I'll probably be standing here forever. Let me try hacking it open. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. You have me worry sick, young man. I can't believe you did this again. I was scared. See, after I left the house, I started to like this one girl. I, I thought I was going to short circuit or whatever when I looked at whenever I looked at her. I never felt that before and it was it was it was scary. There, there, it's all right. Next time we'll go see her together, all right? Okay. Thank you again, truly. I don't have much to give you, but I hope this makes it for some of your troubles. <sighs> oh, and feel free to come visit my child anytime you like. He seems fond of you. 
Thanks, kid. That, <laughs> no, that kid's got issues. <laughs> oh, goodness. Anyway. So we talked to that guy, and now I think he's like, let's go tell his followers exactly what he thinks of them. Uh, I guess I'll have to go all the way to the desert. Alright, we're not going to do that right now. I'm going to continue the main mission for now. I'm going to do a side quest for a little bit. Alright, let's go talk to Classy. Oh, you brought me some high viscosity oil. An enemy is just so kind and understanding. If only all androids and machines can live together in peace like this. Never gonna happen. I guess not. I appreciate it if you could help me out with some of the other help out some of the other machines as well, though. After all, the only way to understand someone is to get to know them. Isn't that right? Fair enough. Uh oh. Oh yes, the guardian. I've got this part. What's that noise? Operator to nine S. Emergency transmission incoming. We've detected a Goliath-class enemy inside the city ruins. It seems to be accompanied by a large number of machine life forms. All Yorha members are ordered to engage at once. A Goliath? This was a trap. I knew it! I promise you, we were not aware of this information. I realize the odds of you believe- Huh? Operator 210 here, do you read me? Operator to 9S, I have bad news and I have good news. Bad first, we've confirmed the presence of two Goliath-class heavy weapon enemies. Uh-huh. Two of them? Now, the good news. We've used your previous Goliath combat data to analyze the enemy. And it seems we have identified a weakness. Command has modified a firing unit based on this new intel. It's been installed on a pair of flight units that are heading your way. That's your R&D for you. All right. Check your map data. Operator out. Thanks, Operator. 2B, Command is deploying new flight units for us. They just set the coordinates, so let's get going. On it. Wait, no, let me climb the tree. What the fudge? Why won't it let me... Actually, I need to come up here. Okay. Time to go to war. Y'all ready for this? I ain't. Okay, guess what? I gotta do the hacking this time. <laughs> the flight units should be on the roof of that building up ahead. It'll be dangerous, but we're not going anywhere unless we pass through that Goliath's legs. <clears throat> we should be careful. We're alive. For now. Upstairs. Ingress?
Oh, sheesh! Shoot, okay. Shoot. Oh, sheesh! Like, I'm trying to hack, so I'm not really watching for the attacks, but I really need to be careful. I ran straight into that. Oof! Ooh! I did it, though! <laughs> Got him. It wasn't on purpose. It just happened. Almost there. Got him. Okay. Let's move. Get to those flight units while we can. Let's use some health. Use a small. Yeah, that should be enough. Come on. Enemy anti air defenses are on patrol at higher altitudes. A low altitude approach is recommended. Got it, thanks. Low altitude approach, okay. Hacking seems to drain of the healths a lot, so I, you're gonna see me use it a lot. Oh! How am I supposed to avoid this? I guess would be on predominantly one size. Oh, nice. Did we did we do it for the most part, at least for now? Target enemies offline. That should do it for the Goliaths. Maybe. Look out! It's recharging! <laughs> This isn't Enemy vibrations good. Are growing in intensity. It's resonating in tandem with the area beneath the combat zone. It just disappeared. What the? Unbelievable. 
the aliens who haven't revealed themselves in hundreds of years were hiding underground? Man, that sucks. Alrighty. I think that's where we're going to stop, actually. Yorha, this is your commander. Yes. For the first time in centuries. We've intercepted a signal belonging to the aliens. These are the creatures that are in direct command of the machine life forms on this planet. If we can destroy them, we can end this long and arduous war once and for all. Our intel team is hard at work attempting to analyze the source of the signal. We need more data. All Yorha units are hereby ordered to pro- we can't let this chance slip through our fingers. Ah, we died! A small android saw a blue board blow dark size. Shoot, we need to go get our body now. Shoot. That wasn't good. It exploded while I was trying to hack into stuff. It exploded right on top of me. Aish. That's not good. That is not good. Oh. Interesting. Just watch me up here. That's nice. Yorha. Oh, my body's like commander. right here. For the first time in centuries, we've here intercepted a signal. I shall repair. Belonging to the aliens. These are the creatures that are in direct command of the machine life forms on this planet. If we can destroy them, we can end this long and arduous war once and for all. Our intel team is hard at work attempting to analyze the source of the signal, but we're not there yet. We need more data. All Yorha units are hereby ordered to prioritize data collection above all else. We can't let this chance slip through our fingers. Glory to mankind. I used command's data to determine the signal source and marked it on the map. But it seems to be underground. Like, way underground. Guess we'll see once we get there. If we're lucky. You're not much for plans, are you, 2B? She's like, no. Plans for what's this? <laughs> Alright. We picked up the signal under the caved in area. Let's go check it out. Now hold your horses now, sir. Oh, is this the race, dude? Mm. You know what? I'm not sure what. Oh, hello. Oh, yeah, the missing intel. Yeah, I think it's the missing intel. Yep. Alert. Signal code detected for missing plug in chip. Marking approximate location on map. I like that, um, you don't have to go through the shield in order to hack them. And I like that when you make one of them explode, it hurts surrounding robots. It's actually really helpful. Goodness, yeah, so what's all these side quests just all of a sudden popping up like daisies? going on over here
Why work hard? Why fight? Just hack them. Don't worry about the electricity shields. Don't worry about getting hit, really. Especially since these hacks are relatively easy. Ooh, this is gonna be this hacking is gonna be very helpful against those dudes like you know who like to um do the sudden electric field around them not allowing for melee attacks. Alert. Signal code detected for missing plug-in chip. Oh, this is the plug-in chip thing. Huzzah. Requested plug-in chip obtained. I wasn't even on purpose. Where do we want to go? What's where are we supposed to be going? Investigate. Oh, the flooded area. Okay. Um, was this a side mission up here or something? Well, it kind of let's say So let's get to a save point. We'll stop. Okay, I need to go eat. So we didn't do much, but we got through a fight. Took a lot less time the last time, probably because we're a whole lot stronger now. So that makes sense. Um, yeah, so the next time, actually, now I think right, we just go down here because there is a um, um, a save point down here. What is this? Analysis. It is a cave caused by the collapse of an open space underground. Why is there such a huge cavern beneath the city? That's a weird looking enemy. Oh, sheesh. Well, I'm not trying to deal with those things. I'm just going down. The ground is caved in. There must have been a hollow down there this whole time. Shoot, there's nowhere to save. Well, let's see. Ah, uh, yeah, save isn't an option right now. Crap! I don't think there's no way to get up. Well, I guess it really doesn't matter. It has saved relatively recently, I'm pretty sure. This hallway looks pretty old. Yeah, I think that's where we're going to stop. I'm getting hungry and tired and all that other stuff. I definitely need to eat before I pass out. <laughs> so, um, yay, we got through the Guardian fight. We got rid of him. Um, and um, we are now in the cave where things have to get crazy. Because I think this is when we get introduced to Eve. Um, or is it Adam? I can't remember. We get introduced to one of them, I think. Or actually, no, we have to fight both of them. That's what happens. Um, and we determine that they want to, I think, kill us or something like that. Oh, so yeah, I have a lot of side quests popping up all of a sudden. So we'll have to see about, you know, grabbing those to figure out if we can get those done. Like, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. <laughs> So this should be fun. Um, all right, so yeah, that is it for today. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys had a good time with this, and I will catch you on the next video. Uh, bye.